guys, welcome back. Chef Rylan here. Today we are going to be making key lime pie bars. For this recipe, you will need six egg yolks, one and three fourths cups of sweetened condensed milk, three fourths of a cup of key lime juice, one and three fourths cups of graham cracker crumbs, six tablespoons of sugar, and three fourths of a cup of melted butter. So the first thing we're going to do is make our graham cracker crust. So all we're going to do is we're going to combine our one and three fourths cups of graham cracker crumbs, our half a stick of melted butter, and then six tablespoons of sugar. And what we're going to do is just gently stir all of this together until all of our graham cracker crumbs are wet and crumbly and it looks like wet sand. When your graham cracker crumb mixture is ready, it's going to look like wet sand. If you need to add more melted butter to it to get to this texture, go right ahead. All right, so now that our graham cracker crust is ready, we're going to put it into our spring form. Now, if you don't have a spring form, that's fine. You can use a regular pie pan. I just like this because once everything is finished, it comes off nice and clean and you have really smooth sides. So we're just gonna put our graham cracker crumbs in there. And we're just going to press firmly down and around so it goes up the sides. I like to use a measuring cup, does not matter what size, so I get a nice, smooth, and even bottom and sides as I'm pressing down. So you're just simply firmly pressing down using the measuring cup as leverage. So I've already set our oven to 300 degrees and it's already come up to temp. So we're going to bake this for about five to 10 minutes in our oven, just until it starts to turn golden and it sticks together. So while our pie crust has been cooking, ours is already out and cooling, but while yours is cooking, you're going to start on the filling. So I've already got my sweetened condensed milk, my lime juice. If you don't have key lime juice, that's fine. Regular lime juice will work as well. And then I'm separating my egg whites from my egg yolks. So you need egg yolks for this recipe. So I'm gonna show you real fast. So here we just have an egg. You just wanna crack it lightly and you wanna break it in half. You're gonna have one bowl for your egg whites. You just simply go back and forth like so. The egg whites will fall into there and then put your yolk into the other bowl. So with our egg yolks in here, we're going to add our sweetened condensed milk. It's pretty sticky, so make sure you have a spatula handy to scrape it all out. Our lime juice. And now we're simply going to mix all three together into a nice smooth mixture. So now that our filling is completely mixed and nice and smooth, all we're going to do is pour it into our already baked pie shell, and it's going to go back into the oven at 300 degrees same temperature that we did our pie shell in, for about 15 to 20 minutes or until it's all set. So our key lime pie just came out of the oven and you'll notice that it is nice and set. It's got a little bit of a wobble to it, but it's not sliding out. So you know that it's been baked long enough. So what we're gonna do is let this cool and then once it's cool, we're gonna put it in our refrigerator for about four hours and then we're going to cut it to serve. So our pie has been in our refrigerator. We had ours overnight. So you can see it's nice and set. So all we're going to do is just release the sides. And then we're going to cut these into bars and we're just gonna keep them on our refrigerator until we're ready to eat them. Thanks for joining us again this time, guys. See you next time.